Hi, I'm Luke, and today I'll be showing you how we're going to make a junk light box. And the first segment of this video is to fit the batteries into our LED pack, which we'll be using to light a box. So the first thing we do is we'll be removing the packaging, like so. And here you see, we have our LED lights, and then we have our box where the battery is supposed to go. So what we'll need to do is we'll need a mini screwdriver here just to unscrew this piece here before we put our batteries in. Just keep turning and that will be releasing there. We should be able to pull the rest out with our fingers there. And then we will slide the top off like so and get our batteries we need for this. We are using three size AA batteries to put into the box. Remember to look which bit is the positive and which bit is the negative corresponding to where it goes in the box. So I've found that and I'm putting the first battery in here. And now we have the batteries in, we can slide this back into position. and then that is secure and we should be able to turn our lights on and there we are so there is our battery pack with the lights fitted and so for the final touch we just turn them off like that take our little screw pull it back in start to turn it and then we take the mini screwdriver again Secure that firmly in, and our battery box is fitted. So remember, of course, this is a really fun exercise and we're making really cool things, but just to keep yourself safe, please remember, do not put any of these in your mouth or anywhere near there. Please do not wrap them around anywhere, especially your neck, because that can be very dangerous and please do not put this anywhere near water as it is an electrical device. So here is the light box that you'll be making. This kind of thing, which is really cool. It's got a really nice design on the inside. What we've got is our lights coming through to shine, creating a light feature inside the box. What we've done is we've safely poked holes through with a pencil around here to be able to thread our LED lights into the box. What I'll be showing you next is how to poke those holes safely through your material. So here we have the piece of material. We're using cardboard for this and a pencil that's fairly sharp, so obviously take care with it. Be careful when using it. And what we're simply going to do is we're gonna push through the card, holding it securely in our other hand, and then we're just gonna turn around in a bit of a circle three or four, five turns, until we have a nice hole there that we can push our light through. I'll show you a couple more. So we push down, turn, and then release the pencil. And we have the hole where we can put our light. So when you've secured your lights, you might want to decorate your box with all kinds of different fabrics just to make it nice and colorful and really cool looking, but also the different fabrics and different materials that you line it with can have different effects on the lighting and can make some really nice effects. So for instance, we have like a really nice lilac tissue paper here. And as you see, when the bulb is hitting the material, we get this really nice kind of soft glow effect that makes it like really warm and inviting your box. Or we can 
reflect it quite strongly against something much more reflective, like this tin foil here. It creates a really nice effect. Or we can use kind of see-through transparent things that will bring a really nice effect to your lights as well. Um, but this is really for you to play with and create and decorate it how you choose because at the end of the day, it's yours. So here are some creative ideas that others have made and we can't wait to see what you do. All you need to do is take a photo of your creation and post it onto social media with the hashtag LightUpLester. Thank you.